Okay, next question, next question is 11. 11 is a P plus 7 square equal 19. Uh, in this case, you apply square root. Now, square root both sides. Square root and square root. This is only p plus 7. It's equal plus or minus square root 19. Because 19 is primary number, we cannot do simplification or anything here. Because p is equal minus 7 plus or minus square root 19. And the solution set is equal minus 7 plus square root 19 comma negative 7 minus square root 19. Done. Okay, number 12 is p minus 10 square equal 200 mm -hmm. now again square root method square root both sides is p minus 10 is equal plus or minus square root 200 200 is 200 and square root 100, I know very well this thing. Now it's p minus 10 is equal plus or minus 10 outside and 2 stay inside. Now p is equal, I'm with 10 to the other side, 10 plus or minus 10 radical 2. Now solution set is 10 plus 10 radical 2, comma, 10 minus 10 right okay in this case I'm using quadratic formula let me copy the quadratic formula minus b plus or minus square root b square minus <coughs> by 2 in our case a is 1 b is 1 and c is 5 plugging in, in the into the formula minus 1 plus or minus square root 1 square minus 4 multiplication by 1 multiplication by 5 divided by 2 just 2 times 1 Mm -hmm. Let me compute the part inside the right. This is 1 minus 20. It's negative 19. Now, so far we have negative 1 plus or minus square root negative 19 divided by 2. Again, square root negative number of the negative number is i. So now, so far we have negative 1 plus or minus i square root 19. 19 is primary number. It's impossible simplification divided by 2. Now you separate a real part is one half plus or minus a square root 19 over 2i. Okay, now solution set is solution set is two complex conjugate solution one half plus square root 19 over 2i comma negative one half minus square root 19 over 2i that's it okay again we use in quadratic formula but a is 1 b is 1 and c is 1 the formula minus 1 plus and minus square root 1 square minus 4 multiplication by 1 multiplication by 1 divided by 2 times 1 
Okay, and the part inside the radical. The part inside the radical is 1 squared, is 1. Minus 4 multiplied by 1 by 1 is 4. And subtraction is negative 3. But so far we have negative 1 plus or minus square root negative 3 divided by 2. Again, this is negative 1 plus or minus i square root 3 positive divided by 2. And I split the solution set is negative 1 half plus radical 3 over 2i comma negative 1 half minus radical 3 over 2i. Final answer. Okay, and in, in 16 I have to solve it again the quadratic equation, but I need by complete square. But the procedure is you copy x squared plus 4x plus the number that is necessary complete square is equal to 10. I, I move it to the right hand side plus box. And remember the shortcut. The shortcut is to find the magic number here. You take 4 divided by 2, always by 2 is 2, and this 2 is square is 4. It's a coincidence, it's 4. 4 and 4. Okay, perfect. Now, I know that this trinomial is perfect square and the factorization is only one binomial x plus 2 squared. Uh, this 2 is the square root this, the 4. So square root 4 is 2 and the square root x squared is x. In the right hand side we have minus 6. Now ready to apply square root problem, square root method. Okay now radical radical is x plus 2 is equal plus or minus i radical 6 and 6 unfortunately we can no simplification because it's only 2 and 3 we have no couple factor so it's like that so it's x is equal negative 2 plus or minus i radical 6 solution set then is negative 2 plus i radical 6 comma negative 2 minus i radical 6 close the parenthesis or close the brace, the brace ok by complete square again so I write x square plus 6x plus a magic number is equal negative 18 plus the magic number for finding the magic number remember you take 6 this 6 is this 6 divided by 2 always by 2 is 3 and this 3 is square is 9 9 here and 9 here that's a 9 we have so far uh, this is perfect square trinomial the factorization is x plus 3 square here in the right hand side we have minus 9 subtraction we put the sign of the bigger number now a square root square root method square root both sides this is x plus 3 is equal plus or minus square root negative 9 is 3i now the solution is I move in a positive 3 to the right hand side like a minus 3 plus or minus 3i and the solution set is then minus 3 plus 3i comma minus 3 minus 3i that's it